turn off the fan. So this is called smudging. What you do is this is part of it. It's actually called mugwort. Okay. Very good for very good for pain relief. I do it the Indian style, but you can do it in. So I do cream on top. So to hold the thing. So what you do is you keep wrapping it. Okay. You are a good good uh, student. Thank you. <laughs> I'm so impressed by the mechanism. So now, right, you, you can finish off with it. Not, you can do it any way you want. So you will dry it, okay? So you put it like around your house. Yeah, and then when it dries, right, what you right. do is, is you will burn the top. When it catches fire, turn it off. Mm -hmm. And then the smoke, you will smudge, oh, yeah. like, yeah. you know, so you will do like your body too, yeah. like axilla, your, uh, your body, uh -huh. yes, yes, yeah, all the chakras, you cleanse by this, you will actually, the smoke itself will take away the body of the pain, but you will also be able to clear your thought forms. In uh, London, they call it mugwort because they will add it to their beer, and they'll drink. And they'll put it under their shoes when they're traveling to take away negative energy that is traveling or they can encounter when they're traveling. So Artemis is for protection. Okay. And in India, they use it for garlands and stuff. So you can, so when you make garlands, you will do with macrame. See like how you do mug in between knots, right? Mm -hmm. So you insert the herb and you can create the whole macrame. Like, like, like see how you do yes. the knots, right? Mm -hmm. So like, in between these two threads, you will put the herbs in, so it will be. Yes. And if for the babies, if you have, if I was tired, this I put that in there. Yes. Underneath. So underneath. then, permanently, even after it dries, it will be with you. And then the other thing is, like you know, for babies, let's say you have colic and stuff, in the macrame itself, you can insert some of these herbs, and you will tie them. And then you create a bracelet. So when the baby rubs its face and stuff, it gets soothing. Now what one is that? Huh? What herb is that? Any herb. Like the, this one is the, like, you know, the, what is it called? Italian oregano. Mm -hmm. Any herb you want. Even this one. If you want to work with some herbs, right? You can put it inside the macrame. And for babies, you will cover it with the bread thread. So when they rub their face and they cry, yes. they inhale that herb, oh. and they can That's good. they can take away their body aches and pain, the colic. I heard uh, lavender yeah. was best for babies. Stuff, yeah, uh, yeah, because they can belly ache and stuff. 